trendybeats.com. to my Apex externship. It is 8.15 in the morning, and this is the first day of my second week of my Apex externship. So, for those who don't know, I've described this briefly in a previous video, but uh, my school, Boston University, has a summer externship program after your first year that's part of the first year curriculum. It's, ex it's essentially like uh, an educated shadowing experience. Um, you know, we go into the externship looking to learn about things that we're gonna see in our second year of school. So I'm getting a lot of exposure to prosthodontic cases, removable prosthodontics, fixed prosthodontics. So crowns, bridges, dentures root canals, all that stuff. It's been very exciting. Uh, last week was my first week. I've been having a lot of fun. And so I decided that, you know, today would be a good day to try to bring you guys along for a day in the life of a dental student on his externship in the summer. If you're new to the channel, my name's Eli. I'm a first year, or in between first and second year dental student at Boston University Henry M. Goldman School of Dental Medicine. On this channel, I make videos uh, vlogging my dental school journey, as well as uh, videos with advice for pre-dental students on how to get to the next steps. So feel free to subscribe to my channel, like the video, comment under the video, share the channel with anyone that you think may find this channel useful. And I really appreciate it. So without further ado, Let's continue on with the vlog. Mm. Is it cream in there? Yeah. Huh. Oh, they didn't put cream. So put it is 9.57. Haven't started working yet because the first patient canceled, which means uh, the doctor is coming in late because that's the type of stuff you can do when you run a practice. Something I look forward to. <laughs> but gonna start getting to work soon. Um, Doctor should be here at 10, it's 9.57, so, yeah. So, part of what I do here is uh, helped write patient notes. It's been a great experience, um, which is helping me learn how to write patient notes, how to sum up a patient visit, etc. Looks kind of short, but we'll see. All right, y'all. So it is now 1:35, and it is lunchtime. But for the beginning of my lunch, my little lunch break, which usually is about an hour from one to two, but you know, things run over time. Right now, during my lunch break, I'm just going to do a little bit of work. Um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you know that I do like my weekly reel of, uh, frequent questions that I'm frequently asked as a dental student. Um, so I'm finishing up the reel that I'm doing for today. Well, this week, and I'm trying to release it today. Um, and then once I finish that, I'm going to head back inside and yeah, um, eat my lunch. I packed lunch today, as you guys saw me grab it on my way out, if I decide to include that. Um, 
Also, uh, I know you guys saw the crown uh, being made, um, and I did like briefly mention that it looked a little short. Um, so I wanted to explain that a little bit. Essentially, uh, the patient came in with a fractured tooth. Uh, the patient had an existing amalgam restoration, which is a silver cavity filling. Uh, and the tooth fractured around the amalgam filling. So, uh, the dentist decided to put a crown over the tooth. What ended up happening is because that tooth was fractured for a long time, the tooth uh, and the opposing dentition, so the tooth on the bottom that usually locks into that tooth on the top started to super erupt, which means it started to come out further out of the gums than it originally was in order to try to catch on to something. And because that tooth was fractured and there was nothing to catch on to, the tooth kept coming up and up. And that's why the crown was short because the, the opposite tooth was so long that it could only be made that short to catch the op opposite tooth. It's hard to explain without pictures. Maybe I'll be able to find pictures online somewhere that I could show you like a, a little example. But I tried to do my best to explain it to the people that aren't in dental school or aren't interested in dentistry that just, you know, watch my vlogs. And I hope that that made some kind of sense. So anyway, got my laptop sitting in the car, about to do a little work and then I'll eat my lunch. Um, I've been recording mostly with my phone today. So if you notice uh, changes in quality, I apologize. I had to sacrifice quality a little bit in order to be discreet in the office and make sure I can give you guys some content. But I am very happy with how the vlog has been going so far today, especially compared to the last time I tried to do it. So hope you guys are enjoying the vlog so far. Um, what I have planned for the rest of the day, work until 5. I know that there's an extraction this afternoon. Uh, I think an abutment to be placed for a implant. I'm not sure. And then after work, I'm going to go to the gym. Y'all are finally going to get to meet some of my friends from home. Or at least someone from home that I go to the gym with. And uh, yeah, you know, I'm glad that I finally get to put some of my home friends on the channel. Because I'm always showing dental stuff, which is at dental school, which is not home for me. That's in Boston. So that's fun. And yeah. That's it. Yes, sir. Your boy is fresh off of work. 502. Not playing no games. This is already free labor. So I am now about to go home. And yeah, I should get home at like, honestly, like 5.15, bro. I'm not even going to lie to you. I should get home at like 5.15, take a little, you know, hour break, hour chill session, and then go to the gym. So as long as y'all have been subscribed to my YouTube Y'all just know, like, dental school me. You know what I'm saying? Like, y'all don't know, like, my home life like that. You know? <laughs> like, I don't know. I, someone had asked me, like, what's the difference between student Dr. Eli and Eli from Baltimore? And it's like, it's no difference. Like, I'm just me. It's just that, you know, I haven't had an opportunity to show y'all, you know, the side of me that's not in dental school but um yeah before dental school like and I know you know y'all may have seen me go to the gym in my vlogs like but before dental school like I was really going to the gym every day like I get off work and go to the gym it doesn't matter how tired I am doesn't matter if I didn't feel like going I was going unless it was a Friday 
Fridays I would go sometimes, sometimes I wouldn't. But now that I'm back home and I don't have to I don't have to study every day and study all day. I just go to work and I get off, I'm going to the gym. But um, overall, today at work was a very nice day. I don't know if I ever really described the practice to y'all, but essentially the practice that I'm externing at, it is um, owned by basically uh, a family. A father and his daughter and son are both dentists at the practice. It's all black. Um, there's also an associate. There's two branches. Yeah, I'm, you know, I don't want y'all coming and find me at work, so I'm not about to give that many details. But yeah, it's, it's a great place to be. I see a lot of cool things. I'm really enjoying my experience so far. You guys see that I get to, you know, do notes and I get to see some nice stuff. I get to talk to people. Um, it's a very friendly practice. And yeah, I've just I've been enjoying it so far. Still got seven more weeks, and I mean it's gonna be a great experience. So anyway, um, heading home. Probably gonna s honestly start editing this vlog, and you know just relax a little bit in the house before I get ready to leave. And I'm gonna go to the gym with my friend George. So it, like Jordan is like my best friend from home, and y'all still have not seen him on the channel like that. At, at all, I don't think so. This is finally the first time I can show friends from home on the channel since I'm home, so it's great. Uh, yeah, all right, I'm back in the crib. Real, the real, oh, excuse me, the real OGs remember this backdrop where my first YouTube videos were made. It's been a minute, it's definitely been a minute. But we here though. So I'm about to do a little bit of work. Maybe. Maybe I'm just gonna just get in the bed for a little bit. I do not know. But I uh, just got home and I'm going to the gym in like an hour. All right, y'all. Seven o'clock. Just got to the gym. About to get this work in. Uh, waiting for Jordan. But I'm probably about to just go inside and then. Start some cardio and he'll pull up soon. All right, y'all. Ooh, I'm tired. Just leaving the gym. Um, I think I'm gonna close out the vlog here. Might just chill with some friends and watch the finals tonight. Um, hope y'all enjoyed this vlog, this day in the life. Um, hope y'all enjoyed, you know, what I was able to show you at my externship. Um, if you have any questions about the day in the life or be used apex externship program or anything like that please let me know uh i'll you know i'm gonna try to see if i can get some more vlogs in um before it ends but i don't want to be redundant so yeah thanks for watching i'll see y'all in the next video peace